Well, uh, Daryl, congratulations. That was was much more what we've come to expect from Rovers over the years. No, it was a, it was a pleasing, uh, pleasing performance. I thought uh, first half we had a couple of great chances to take the lead, and you, you, you stood in the dugout and thinking, "Here we go, deja vu again." But uh, no, the boys' commitment, the commitment, and the desire has been there. But we've been lacking that little bit of quality in the final third at times over, certainly over the last. Uh, you know, a few months, so it's, it's pleasing that we was a bit more clinical today, but you could even be more clinical at times, but uh, no, pleased with the effort. Yeah, obviously that first goal was important, and why it wasn't the strikers who scored it, they worked well to set it up for Ollie. No, listen, my me, me front two has worked very hard, I don't care who scores the goals, as long as we're scoring goals, that's, that's always been my motto to be honest with you, obviously strikers getting confidence from scoring goals, but as long as you're scoring as a team and you're winning games, that's what it's all about, really pleased for... Uh, contingent of fans that have come up and supported us and got right behind the team today as they always do give us the best possible chance so it's, it's, it's pleasing to send them home happy today yeah, 500 on, on the back of the results you've been getting yeah the, listen, yeah, listen I'm, I can't speak highly enough of our fans I think they know I think they know the score they're, they're only set of fans I think they know where we're at at the, at, at the minute we're trying to grind out results we're looking pretty solid as a team defensively it's another clean sheet to take the positives that's wipes the goal difference out as well so positives to take from the game but certainly no, no carried away from me I think uh, the game the league should I say is fairly competitive I think uh, you've seen that in all the games we've lost games by the odd goal hopefully that gives the boys a bit more confidence and uh, a belief and we'll uh, try and enjoy the next couple of cup games and, and, and then back to the men What's your emotion? Is there a, a small sense of relief ah, playing listen, well without the results? Another seven days in the job in it when a game of football so it's just I keep saying it, they're a hard-working, honest bunch of players, but we've needed more quality at the top end. That's, that's the only thing that's been missing. You can see that by the goals for and the goals against Colum. The scoring moments, key moments at times where, you know, like I said, first half you think that's going to happen again. So, no, please, please, long way to come. Long journey, good three points. You might see many better strikes than the, the second one from uh, Tony Craig. A long Lionel time Messi. to look at that, Lionel, didn't Messi. Lionel Messi, it's a pit designer, you know, I can't speak highly of him. You know, that, that sort of leadership that you need in your change rooms for times like this. When it's not easy and you, everyone's cutting a lot of stick, rightly so, but we haven't been getting the results, so you have to take that. But uh, he epitomises what we're about as a club and we'll keep working on it. And Ollie Clark, you know he's always been a proper with Goldie, he has done pretty much he's the He's through and through, isn't he? I mean, yeah, I've never ever seen him not have an honest game. If he makes a mistake, it's an honest mistake. He's one of those that you know, loves the club. The players have been hurting, they care, I know they do. You know, I'll be getting them out of the building, or they want you to be near me 18, to be honest with you. I know they care, and I know they're a passionate group as well, and they want to do well for the football club, but we've got to do better. So you're not getting carried away, we still need a lot more. We still need to keep working hard to, to get more more results like this. And you mentioned the defensive record, isn't it? seven clean sheets in 12 for, uh, for you in the last 12 matches. That, that's pretty impressive. Well, listen, it's, it's a day to day where it all came together, isn't it? We finished our chances, uh, we've got three goals and we kept a clean sheet, so it's, it's an enjoyable day for that, but not getting carried away. And a couple of cut matches now, so nice to have that as a, a nice taste. In the uh, listen, you want to get a momentum in the league, we need to get some momentum in the league. We know we're not. We're not uh, it's, it's tight league, but we need to get more results. So uh, first and foremost, he's, he's trying to secure our League One status and build from there. It's, uh, it's three points today, and then, like you say, a couple of cup games. That coach journey home is going to be a little bit easier, though, isn't it? Uh, they're level-headed, yeah. It's a lot easier, to be honest with you. But uh, yeah, we'll enjoy today, but we'll be back in work.